Hey guys, I wanted to kind of update you on what has been going on with me for the past month. So you've seen my birthday vlog and some random vlog I did on like January 14th. Um, and it's February 13th now. So a lot has happened obviously since January 18th. Um, Dino got his wisdom teeth out and um, two days later, my cat is um, rubbing his face against the thing that my camera is on so if it wiggles that's why um two days after dino got his wisdom teeth out i was like cooking for him and stuff like that as you should do because you're kind of out of it the first day or two um so yeah i was doing that and then on the third day i got sick and it was some sort of abdominal um either bacterial infection or viral infection <clears throat> and we still don't know because my test results came back inconclusive basically negative for the stuff that they tested for but they only test for like the worst stuff I guess so um, that came back negative so we don't actually know what it was it's gone now I was on antibiotics for seven days like a really powerful antibiotic for seven days and now I'm in like the recovery stage because it was pretty severe um, symptoms for me and I was in bed for five days I was barely eating anything I was just trying to stay hydrated um, that was a worry for me I was pretty dehydrated um, and I was trying to eat to get my strength because I felt like I had none and um, I was just in bed for a long time and then I finally started to feel better things started to turn around and I was still I had to eat like rice and crackers all day every day and like an apple and um, I remember it, was, it wasn't until I started eating like bananas and more substantial food that I started to feel way better so I got my energy back um, it's been a couple days since I've been off the antibiotics so I've been taking probiotics um, multiple times a day I've been um, eating more variety of foods and I still am kind of <clears throat> I'm getting to the point where I can eat much more variety of foods but I'm still kind of abstaining from like cheese and heavy meats um, and like processed meats and stuff like that because um, it's just a little too much for my digestive system right now I think it's it's getting there though it's definitely getting there I'm feeling so much better I feel pretty much normal um, I started getting allergies yesterday um, I don't know from what but it was just last night I just started sneezing so hopefully that goes away hopefully that's just like dust or something um, because I start school in two days <laughs> yeah I start school in two days so and I'm moving so that's what's going on with me I got sick and two weeks later I'm feeling better <laughs> I still can't eat practic I'm, I'm technically not on restrictive dieting at all like doctor's orders um, I can eat anything I want but I know my body and I think cheese and heavy meats is still probably not a good idea. Um, it'll, it would probably be fine, but I would probably feel like crap. So I don't want to feel like crap. Um, I'll probably wait to at least a couple more days until I eat those things. So just get my digestive system back in gear, you know. <clears throat> and um, yeah, so two weeks later I'm feeling better, but I have school in two days and it's full time um it's gonna be full time for the next couple months so busy 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 and we're moving so gotta get all that stuff in order and i'm going to my brother's wedding um in a week and a half or something and so there's that and i'm just I'm just like thank god that that happened to me before like right before all of this 
because I have to go to school and I can't miss two weeks of school because I was out for like two weeks. I was like not functioning right <laughs> where I didn't want to get out of bed or get out of the house or anything. So I'm really glad that that all happened like when it did, like the timing could not have been more divine for that to happen. And I really, I thought about it and I was like, wow, it's actually amazing the timing that that, that occurred because it's like, it taught me a lot for one. Um, I'll briefly get into that. It like getting that sick um, and having some sort of infection or viral bug or something. Um, it really taught me a lot because when I was in bed, um, I felt pretty hopeless, right? And then I was watching, I have to tell you guys, okay, this channel, this YouTube channel, I watched nonstop. I mean, this really got me through. And if you're going through a tough time, watch this YouTube channel that I'm about to tell you. It's called Michael Jameson. That's, it's just his name, okay? Michael Jameson, J-A-M-I-S. O N, um, and he has two tigers. He lives in South Africa. He has a bunch of cats, a bunch of dogs, uh, monkeys. He runs a monkey daycare, and um, and he's just like the the nicest guy ever. And the kinds of stuff he talks about, he posts every day, pretty much, sometimes twice a day, um, of just him feeding his animals, talking about his life. Um, talking about the lives of his animals and their behaviors and personalities and things that's happened to him He's a really interesting person and the kinds of things that he says in his videos is very helpful He has a lot of insights messages his animals have a lot of insights and messages and It's just beautiful and it really helps you to it helps me to see the beauty in everything like I don't want to take anything for granted. I love my cat, I love my dog, I love my little family here. Just walking outside is like a gift, you know? And sorry if it's noisy out there, I think there's cars and stuff, but walking outside just, I mean, the first day I went outside after being sick was amazing. I just thought everything was so beautiful and perfect, everything is so perfect. And, um, yeah, being in that mindset of everything is perfect, um, prepare for the best, do not prepare for the worst, prepare for the best, um, the best, you'll bring that to you, you'll bring the best to you, and, um, you know, bad things happen, but, um, it's all good, it's always gonna be okay, um, and that really got me through, so, Definitely, I'll probably link his channel below and definitely check him out, especially if you're having a hard time, especially if you're just don't know how to get out of bed in the morning or in the afternoon or night or whatever that is for you. If you just feel hopeless or if you feel like scared or anxious, um, that sort of thing, depressed, definitely check out his channel. Just watch a video and then look in the recommended and just keep watching those videos until you start to feel like i love my life again <laughs> like i can live this life it's okay like i can definitely live this life and i can keep going so um definitely check that out and um i think that's all i got for you that's that's my update i was sick i'm going to school i'm better now i feel better um, I'm gonna be busy from now on. I'm gonna try to vlog, um, especially during the move or after the move. I'm definitely gonna try to vlog some stuff, um, especially on the weekends because I'll be in school, you know. Um, so I, I can't vlog like every day, um, nor would I really want to because you guys know me, like, I obviously don't vlog every day. Um, but I'll try to vlog a couple times a month at least, at least, to give you guys some updates of what's going on. So, um, I think that's about it. Uh, we're moving super soon, so, 
you'll get to see some of that and um yeah uh have a good day bye